guys what is up it is destiny and i'm here again with another video so it's really early actually it is currently 6 3 a.m and i am on my way to clinic um so as you can tell by the title of this video for this video i'm going to show you guys the day in the life of a sonography student like myself clinical edition so like i said it's about 603 604 um, I'm getting ready to go to clinic. Um, clinic days are my early days. I was up around 5.45ish. Um, and really, it doesn't take me long to get ready because I literally do everything at nighttime so I can sleep in longer. Think smarter, not harder. And yeah, I literally do everything at night. So really, the only thing I have to do in the morning is just my morning routine, wash up, put on my clothes, grab my lunch and go and get on the road. So this video is probably going to be over the course of a couple days, weeks, just because I'm just so busy and I really don't have time to film. So this video is going to be, y'all going to get this video when you get it. Okay. But y'all are going to see in this video what my day is like when I go to clinic. So if you would like to continue watching and see what my life is when I have clinic, stay tuned. So I'm about to be on my way to my site and since my site is an hour away, I always leave early just to give myself extra time. So whenever you're at a clinical site and you have to be there early, there's somebody behind my car, um, always leave early just, just because there might be traffic um, and you don't want to be late to your site. So I always leave like super early and I get there early and I just chill. So I'm just putting in my um address in here so when i'm on my way to my clinical site i always just put the address in even though i know how to get there just to give me an estimate on when my arrival time is going to be and with my car it like tells me if there's traffic or anything so it really is beneficial and plus i just like to be kind of like ahead of time and just know where i'm going to be Hey y'all, so I have made it to my destination. Um, I had to make a quick pit stop because I was hungry and I didn't pack breakfast. Um, usually I meal prep, so I have like breakfast to take with me, but I just didn't meal prep this week. So I only have a lunch. I just, I didn't have a breakfast. So I just stopped at Wawa and I got me a blueberry muffin um some apples and then i got this um starbucks double shot energy drink not sponsored mm. i haven't actually had this one i've had like the other ones that come in the glass bottle but they didn't have any and y'all honestly i didn't start drinking like coffee caffeine drinks until i got in this program and look when you, if you're in sonography school, you understand me, or if you're getting ready to be in sonography school, y'all are going to be tired and y'all going to need something that's going to like help you get through the day. So I, for some reason, I'm just super tired this morning. Um, I really only got like five hours of sleep because it just took me a while to fall asleep last night. And plus I worked last night. So and I got off at like nine something and then it takes me forever to get myself together. So I didn't go to sleep till like 12 o'clock. So we gonna see if this helps me, but it is currently 728 and I don't have to be the clinic till eight. So I usually walk in the hospital around 750 ish just to give myself enough time. And yeah, so I'm just gonna chill here. And as y'all saw in like my previous videos, as I'm driving, it is dark outside. Like that's the worst part about having like a far away site is 
like that. Depending on what time of the year it is, it's gonna be dark when you're driving to your site and I just don't like driving when it's dark outside because my eyes are already bad as it is. But enough of me rambling. I'm just gonna sit here, eat my breakfast, listen to some music and just, you know, chill out till I have to go inside the hospital. So yeah. Alrighty y'all, I'm headed to clinic and as you can see, it's light outside now. So, yeah. so when I'm about to go in the hospital, I just like to go in about 10 minutes early just to give myself enough time to set my stuff down and to clock in. And normally when I'm in clinic, I always bring my textbook with me just so I can read up on things. So on this day at clinic, it was like super busy and like it was exam after exam. And so when you're in clinic, you may have to get used to that. But anyways, this is a GE Logic 9 machine that one of our exam rooms has at the clinical site that I was at. Also in my um, clinical facility, we used a Philips machine and we used this one in lab. So honestly, this machine was really easy for me because I was more familiarized with the buttons and all that jazz. And as you can see, you saw the TGC 2D gain acquire button and all the important buttons for ultrasound. And also another machine that we use at my clinical facility was the GE Logic 10. And honestly, this was my favorite machine because it was just so nice and pretty and I just felt like it was very advanced. Also, when you're in a clinical facility, this might be the typical setup of an exam room. So you have your machine, stretcher. Also my exam room, we had Trophon machines because we did a lot of transvaginal exams. And also within the room, you'll have gloves, linen, extra gel, and all just the necessary things you may need for an ultrasound exam. At my clinical facility, usually I would have some downtime and I would just read up on like possible exams that I would see later that day. So I know at my site, there was a lot of vascular stuff. And even though we weren't on that material in class, I still just like to glance at the information in the textbooks just so I have an idea of what I'm looking at when I'm observing an exam. So literally when there's about maybe an hour or so left of my clinical time, I usually just try to stock linen and just help out the staff as much as I can. And as you can see, there was like no linen in the cabinet. So this is just me just helping stock the linen cabinets and just trying to pass time because y'all, I cannot stand to sit in clinic and not do anything. It just makes time go by much slower. So I just try to help out as much as I can just to help time pass by and just to also help around in the department because even though I'm there to learn, I'm also there to help as well. Normally I leave clinic around 4.30 and that's if an exam doesn't run over. Honestly, I don't even know when I left right here in this video, but just know it was time for me to go. <laughs> hey y'all, so I just finished my day at clinic. It's about 4.36 and I, um, I leave clinic around 4.30. An exam ran over, so that's like the only reason why I, like, I left, but it was okay. Um, the site that I'm at, I see a lot of OB, GYN cases and like um, abdomen, so it wasn't too bad. So I'm on my way home. It's about an hour drive and I have to do a lot of homework when I get home. So yeah, so that was my day at clinic. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe for more content. Bye!